I firmly believe that um, how and what we eat is who we are. I think it was Bertrand Russell who said there is no more sincere love than the love of food. I think that to me, food is a looking glass into that culture. Wherever you're at, whatever country or city or even neighborhood in the States that you're in, to understand where the locals eat, to go and try that, read the menu, go to the market, you really understand who those people are. The uh, drive towards taste and flavor is the elemental part of us because anyone who's seen a newborn baby knows that the first thing after breathing the baby wants to do is feed. So it's who we are and it's absolutely can't be separated and I, I think that that's why we have slightly separate tastes. We like certain different foods which is why eating the food of someone else's childhood can be fabulously exciting because Everyone has a different truth, just like everyone has a you know, slightly different personality. In the best way, food can connect us and tell a story about why we eat the way we eat. And you want to invite a friend into that conversation and that dinner and in a prideful way saying, hey, we eat this part and we cut our meat this way. Isn't that great, you know? Food has that common denominator that allows us to slow down and enjoy life and smell the coffee, so to say. We're all original, and yet we share so much. So food is the one common language. It doesn't matter with you when you speak, you, eat, you speak French, you speak German, you speak uh, Chinese. The one common language we have is food, and that connects us all.